Hello people, this is George with yet another behemoth killing the video. As you can see, we are watching the Elite Magma Demon uh, capture take. As you know, we are into the season 2 plus and Elite Behemoths are really really strong. So let's see how Immortal Legion will take care of Elite Magma. Mm, the gameplay is pretty simple. I have taken the normal one. I have never taken the elite one. With the normal one, you need to get spread into the four quarters around the every single boss. And you need to take them down uh, kinda together. Also, like as you can see, there is some skills on the legions. And uh, there you need to rotate whenever uh, there is like skill too much. So let's see how... Um, Immortal Legion will be able to defeat this uh, Elite Magma Demon, right? Almost every single player here is uh, kind of tier 5. So let's see, now they are trying to rotate. This is kind of complicating uh, Behemoth because you need a good coordination. Uh, because like on the ground the bosses are hitting with the skills. You need to rotate, you need like every uh, single quarter has his own healing and yeah, uh, it's not easy and let's see if they will be able to uh, capture it, right? Like it, pit is so big, it's hard to uh, capture every single boss and like main main uh, heroes in the magma re uh, behemoth is marksman of course, marksman and some infantry. This looks pretty cool. Uh, some infantry religions are waiting until they will be able to take the town to, from the every single uh, behemoth. It's time to rotate. Like there is, like, you need like couple of times uh, the rotation uh, in order to kill the uh, magma. And yeah, like every single boss here, like as you can see, there is four bosses, right? Uh, almost like four behemoth. Every single one of them has like different uh, debuffs, different skills. So you need to be constantly talking with your guys and it's not easy. It's a big uh, behemoth race. And also like uh, Magma Demon is important because uh, it's soon it's season uh, reset. New season is going to start and every alliance want to have a better rewards. And Magma is giving you the better rewards, right? One of the demons uh, has like 2.8 million uh, HP. Uh, none of the enemies, none of the legions uh, died, so it's pretty cool. As always, whenever you see some circles around the pit, you need you know that you need to avoid them, right? So far, they are doing amazing. Uh, like it's pretty obvious that it's not the first time they are doing this, right? So. That's why it's a good demonstration on how to kill uh, Elite Magma uh, in Call of Dragons, right? By the way, today I made a great video, Kinara Guide, my favorite uh, hero, legendary hero. If you want to check it out, it's on my channel. Well, they are doing amazingly well. They have not even lost a single member. And it's been like four minutes uh, since they started the fight, right? One of the demons has like 3.3 .3 million HP. I guess they need to focus that. But still, they have like three uh, infantry legions, uh, AFK. In, in order like if th something, something will happen, like they will come and uh, help taunt the boss so far everything looks great they only they just lost one legion which is pretty surprising because they have been fighting for a long time already again one more rotation let's see let's see these guys are the winners of my kingdom uh, that's why like we are watching from the winner's perspective. 
uh, I believe they have the higher chance of defeating the elite behemoth in our server, so that's why whenever you see guides in Season 2 Plus about behemoths, they are mainly here. Simply because they are strongest alliance, which I have ever seen, actually. So far, everything looks great. They only lost two legions, and they are close to the finish line. Yep, once again, another rotation, they lost three legions, which is at this stage pretty fine. So we are getting closer and closer to the last stage of this fight. They are getting healing. So yeah, it, I'm pretty surprised they only lost three legions. Well, yeah, tier 5 legions are too powerful, I guess. They are pretty close to defeating one of their magmas, two actually. I guess they are using their artifacts, right? Yep, yep, that's why they deal the high amount of damage. One of the magmas are almost gone, I guess it's this one. Yes, one of the magmas are gone, so three is left. Uh, one had like 1.6 million uh, HP, but I think it should not be a problem for them, right? Yep, everything looks great. This is, guys, how you take Elite Magma, Demon. Actually, it's my first time watching it. The Elite one, of course, I have taken normal one before. So, yeah. This demon is getting focused right now, and the next one will be this one, almost done, 300,000 HP. Okay guys, keep it up. So three bosses are left. So let's see. Yep. Two bosses left, uh, basically they are almost done. I guess this one has the highest uh, HP currently. Yep, that's why they are focusing, focusing the Devourer. Pretty, kinda basic whenever you are watching a good alliance taking it, right? But it's not that easy, like... A lot of people are around here and everybody should be coordinating uh, themselves, so one uh, behemoth is left. And this one, out of four. And we will be congratulating the Immortal Legion once again by killing Elite uh, Magma Demon in Season 2+. Plus. So yeah, it looked kinda easy, but it's not. Whenever you are playing yourself, you understand that it's not easy. So yeah. Magma Reaper is done. And as this game says, congratulations to Immortal Legion for defeating uh, Elite uh, Magma. Yeah, this is the guide for the Magma. And yet again, congrats to the Immortal Legion. Uh, this is all I wanted to share, guys. Thanks for watching, and I, I, I will see you very, very soon. Bye-bye.